we need to trust each other. We need to trust each other. We need to trust each other as Africans to trade with one another, to do business with one another, but also to uh, use and share our knowledge and exchange our knowledge uh, with one another. And uh, unfortunately, I think that um, one of the uh, remnants of uh, colonialism is that, is the profound mistrust that we have for one another. Mm, I, I have a different view of, of that. Uh, I don't think that mistrust uh, comes from colonialism. It comes from our diversity and the way we have been with one another even before colonialism. See, see if you... Ah, oh, man. If you read... Uh, Mokadima. Yeah. I think that's what that's what is called by uh Ibrahim Kadun, a for a, a, a 14th century scholar, a Tunisian scholar. He talks about uh uh Asabiya. You see, check, check it out later. See, he, 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 the thing is that tribes have that tendency to not trust the next tribe okay it has it has always been there so for for me if we want to start trusting each other in the modern modern world now well the legal system will help us if we build a legal system that is impartial okay now it, it will take time okay for it to work but if we build the system and start working one year two years three years four years ten years now when you and i do business together and the system works in a very impartial way and it does what it's supposed to do when we have these skills. After a while, we start trusting each other. Even yeah. in Europe, okay, the Germans and the English, the English and the French didn't trust each other. Mm -hmm. They fought a lot, a lot of wars. But today, they trust each other better than they used to because of the system they, they, they have built together. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. So I think uh, we need to we need to build those systems that will eventually help us integrate better. You know. Yeah. yeah. Good point. Wow.